All right, so we're racing against Global. Yeah, I hate Global, actually. But we're going to have Whoa. a fun time here. <laughs> you may have heard him already. Actually, you probably see the title. Uh, you may even be coming from his part, too. But I'm here today with the Mass Ningen. Uh, say hello, buddy. Hi. Yo, how's it going, everybody? Glow best. Global W, shout out to everyone that pulled the anniversary LLs off the global exclusive tickets. You know what? I'll say that is a global win. If you got them for the tickets, let us know in the comments below. What about that, huh? <laughs> Uh, that kind of <laughs> that unintentionally rhymed anyways um <laughs> today we're gonna go into the gamma's red zone actually and we're gonna race with the eighth anniversary teams itself now uh you see we're both running the gt duo here this is part one part two uh which is obviously going to be recorded after this will be on mingan's channel so feel free to check it out after that it'll be in the description below but yeah, we're running, I, I, I assume we may be running different teams. Now, obviously. Who knows? Uh, <laughs> I mean, for sure, because you see right here, I have a well, GP yeah. exclusive unit here, Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Now, before yeah. you guys are like, well, actually that doesn't make things fair. And that is true, <laughs> right? You have to keep, <laughs> so there's a caveat to that, right? Since it's global versus GP, Negan is like, you could use Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Yeah, I, I said he could, so, you know? Yeah, and with me we're gonna make sure that uh, at least to keep things a little more fair i can't skip standby skills right just like how you can't skip in on global because i feel like at that point it becomes a little too unfair so yeah. i'm gonna have to not only go into my settings turn off the skip animations just to play the either gt duo or super saiyan 4 goku standby skill i have to sit through the extra animation if i want to go into oob and super saiyan 4 goku while Ningen doesn't have to go through that so there is the disadvantage to me having the ability to use goku as a, strong as he is right you could even think of it as a potential downside in terms of trying to win in a race but besides that um i think we're all set here is there anything else you know you kind of want to point out about the race maybe uh the only other thing we said obviously so this part is uh gt duo like versus gt because it's not you know gt duo versus boo duo it's global versus jp so we're not allowed to use the opposite unit on the team so this is the gt duo squaring off against each other so no boo duo allowed on the team and then we'll do the same thing for part two so you won't see the boo uh the gt duo on the teams in part two but yeah other than that i think we are all good to go so if uh since it's you're the host if you want to count us down i am absolutely ready to go yeah i was like oh, are you gonna count me down on my part bro <laughs> <laughs> no i wouldn't dream of it <laughs> i know you wanted to in the back of your mind. no <laughs> okay so i'll count us down on go we'll go so it'll be three two one go all right yep three two one okay right, let's hop in here also by the way i changed my support memory to the boma one uh and you quick cut right there but we're we're hopping in here we're, we're gonna game <laughs> we're, we're looking good here um we're gonna be gaming yeah so my rotations mm. are a little better i think right mine are all right um i could float off orange piccolo instantly and get him with boma so i think that's a good thing but he's not gonna have his intro up and he's not taking any hits well that's that is actually <laughs> unfortunate huh Oh, oh. Yeah, getting him built up early is good. I did, I think it was one of the videos I put up like yesterday or the day before, but I think he was in like slot seven in an event where, oh no, I think he had been on a turn, but he just didn't get any hits. And then I was in like an int phase and I just kind of autopilot. I was like, oh, well, I'll put Piccolo in slot one because he's a god. And then, yeah, he took like quite a lot of damage. I was like, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> was like, Oopsie, right? Without his intro, he, um, especially if he's not fully built up, he can take quite a bit of damage. So yeah that's the only interesting <laughs> about it um and the an issue is that i have to push the super saiyan fours off the rotation next turn so that they're not going to get as many stacks mm. the good thing is that gt duo might move through this quicker because of the fact that they're going to be on rotation so they're going to get more and more stacks right um they're taking four hits i think right here yeah, so they could t I could technically use the Spirit Bomb Act Disco whenever I want with this one. So nice. That's not like it's not the worst thing ever. I think it, it, it's it's okay for what I got right here. Um, the funny thing is that um, yeah, so I have to push them off here. Ajo Gohan, I guess he's just gonna do a thing here. Yeah. Whatever. See, the problem I might have is that uh, Ajo Gohan's in slot yeah. seven for me, so there is obviously the possibility that he. Uh, 
is going to have very, very few stacks as I get close to the end, which is definitely not going to be good for him. But Luckily, Gohan has, he has a high chance to plays out. the androids, right? So that's going to be mm. very helpful for him. Plus, at um, least, I guess, you know, if as long as you stay above that HP threshold, he does have his guard, so hopefully he's yeah. uh, not going to get destroyed. But <laughs> So, yeah, your team, I think we uh, probably, from the sounds of the units that we've mentioned already, are probably running very similar teams apart from one unit. So, obviously, you're using LR, full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Yeah. Um, you said already Piccolo, Bulma, Gohan. Do you say you're using the seven-year LR Super Saiyan 4s as well? Yeah. Uh, you say yep. it as well, so you're using the two half. Yeah. So I think the only unit that's different then is you're using full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Uh, I'm using uh, Vegeta and Trunks because I think they're decent on this team, obviously because they're on Battle of Fate. Um, I put them in slot one and then have the GT duo in slot two. So I, I feel like that rotation well. works decently well. But yeah, I think I do like how that rotation works out, actually. We'll grab this here. Oh, the key is... Okay. Okay, well, that's going to be an issue oh, with well. my GG Duo at the end. They're going to get one super attack off, and there's like four attacks. <laughs> so well, well here's where we see if slot seven Gohan can hold his own, because uh, <laughs> he's getting attacked like four times in slot three here on this turn. So uh, and let's see. Uh... <laughs> this Gamma one being in right here kind of still does suck, because mm. Piccolo is still not going to be able to build up. Really, like, I have to put him in slot two, basically, right? So yeah. That, that is a little unfortunate. And if, if he supers my Goku and Vegeta, that's going to potentially cause issues. Because um, mm. they're going to take quite a lot of damage, I feel like, with only 10% <laughs> reduction in one super attack, right? They didn't even get their 18 key, right? Because key kind of... Like, I, I didn't think the key orbs would fall the way they did, but they did, so that sucks, right? Yeah, that's unfortunate. One of the things, actually, I noticed, it's funny, I see people say in comment sections sometimes, it's like, how do you still not know how this works? But, like, the number of times I, like, I guess you could say misplay, like, I click the orbs and it's like, oh, those did not fall the way I wanted them to. And you would think, after playing the game for, like, six years or so oh, at this no. point, I would probably understand how that works a bit better, but... Nope. <laughs> I mean, oh god, that's a lot of damage. When you're like Ooh, mid recording, 17K. it's kind of different. Oh, Don't super me. Oh, good. The Bulma support memory came in through here. You know, I'll put Orange Pickle in the first slot. I'm not afraid. This sucks. <laughs> I hate everything. Are you four orbs with Bulma? No. I can't four? get her support. Oh, that oh, is Orange Pickle, unfortunate. You're taking a lot of damage. Good, good. Take that damage. Oh, nine orbs for Bulma. Yeah, I'll take those. Yeah, good for you. Where are you at, right now, <laughs> uh, I'm on Gamma 1, the Me int too. one, right? Yeah. So. Oh, 15 million attacks that from Piccolo. Let's go. Uh, yeah, good job, you. Okay. When you get those hits in, baby. Although well, he's got type disadvantage, though, so he didn't crit, so he good. didn't really do any damage. <laughs> okay, Ajo, Gohan, finish him off here. You got this. It is buddy. so funny, like, it's so funny seeing how get much him. type disadvantage really go. does affect characters, because you're hitting these, like, crazy attack stats. Gohan, but then so if you don't crit, you do, like, no damage, God, so. <laughs> it's unfortunate, okay. Um, oh, 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 okay. I'm going to use a standby here, actually, with Oob. Um, oh. Just... It may be stupid, but I'm going to use the Oop standby here so I can get full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku out. Because this is the end of the Gamma 1 phase. So I'm just going to take Oop out here real quick. We're going to make sure I use this. Now I have to play this animation. It looks really, really good, but that might hold me back. Um, yeah, see, I don't have... I think one of my GT duos will have their standby up on the next turn, but I haven't got any available to be used at the moment. So so. Here. We're actually going to kind of full heal here. Uh, because of that, so actually, I think that works out for the better. I could use the spirit bomb next turn, huh? Should I use the spirit bomb next turn? I think I might. I get that full Ooh. mega support pog. And then yeah, because that's the thing is, it's kind of the big trade off. It's like you have to watch the standby animation, but then you get eighty percent attack support. Which, if it's the rotation with uh, Goku, then it's obviously he's going to uh, he's going to go crazy. But Orange Piccolo yeah. might do a lot of damage to Gamma too here. That's the thing. So I'm going to use it, right? Ooh. Maybe you may be thinking, that's stupid. Well, you know what, viewer? Maybe it is. Well, you know, it's, it's well okay. the fun <laughs> thing is as well is the people watching it can actually see how far I am compared to you. So depending on whether which one of us is ahead, 
you using it or not might be a really good idea or a really bad idea but at yeah. the moment neither of us can tell so i mean where, where are you at right now i'm like so i'm at gamma one and two but I'm, right I'm trying to see how much damage uh i'm in the middle of doing a super attack at the moment so okay, see um, they're both uh, around half health so oh, okay well i'm like uh, i just started the turn against them like literally just barely the gamma one's gonna super piccolo if he kills here, that'd be kind of funny. <laughs> Don't kill here. Uh, I want to actually attack this turn. That'd be great. Ouch. Three. Okay, okay, okay. How, what what damage is Piccolo going to do here, huh? Let's see, let's see. Um, 15 mil against Gamma 1. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Piccolo, once you get those hits in, like, it's actually crazy how good Piccolo is or how good he can be, like, especially because it's getting the hits, like, it's RNG related, of course, but, like, uh -huh. if you can get turn one and there's, like, four or five attacks in slot one, it's why events like Metal Cooler Core, like, God. he just goes crazy because the army attacks you so many times in those first couple of turns. And just seeing him dropping, like, you know, over <laughs> 10 mil on turn one while being almost invincible like when his guard is up is crazy how good he is are like only at like uh what's it called 80 percent like each right now both of them. but i'm definitely gonna die here gg vegeta is not gonna be able to live oh this. i was about to say oh no you're gonna die but then yeah i guess you you used the standby didn't you so yeah, you kind of right. want to die because so I, I mean that spirit bomb that could make a big difference right i might have done more damage to them so far but okay. especially if you crit like that so, spirit yeah. bomb can we'll make see. a huge difference. We'll see right here. The did he live? Bomb is about to hit oh, gamma did. One. So, how, how, where are you? Where are they right now? I'm about to hit the. Well, so one. gamma. Uh, I thought I'd killed gamma one, but he survived with the tiniest sliver of health. So unfortunately, the additional super from the GT duo was to basically take away an almost invisible health bar. But, yeah, and then, well, um, gamma two. I assume he's almost dead for you. Yeah, gamma two. I'm getting an additional super here with Gohan. If he crit, he didn't crit. So he's got. A little bit of health left. Yeah, me too. Yeah, no, um, I lost. I feel like I definitely lost here. Because it's like, I have, I have to use the standby skill with Super Saiyan 4 Goku. So. Oh, wait, yeah, we're effective shit. against all types. So if I just super with Bulma and stuff. I've used Bulma's active skill. So because she gets effective against all types, she should kill Gamma 2. Because uh, yeah. she wouldn't normally, of course. but That sucks. Because yeah, 10.5 mil for her. Up. See, that's, Come on, that's baby. the thing though, like I was saying, me having to use the standbys, like the actual oh, Goku standbys, right? Yep. Um, that puts me at a disadvantage in this scenario. So, okay, now I could actually skip the LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta though, which is a good thing. Um, All right, I just hit the star. So. The what? I guess the thing is, that's the big difference is obviously like, it makes sense, as we said at the beginning, to kind of even it out that you have to watch the standby abilities because obviously I have no choice. But yeah. I guess just because of the way it played out, I actually didn't even get the opportunity to use either of them. So like, even if I had wanted to take that risk, I didn't actually get either of them available at any point. So because I didn't watch any of them, I obviously <sighs> didn't have to go through those like extra few seconds. You said but... you already got in the, in the past, right? Yes. Oh uh, yeah, no, I lost for sure. That really does suck. Um, Did you hit? Have you finished? No. Uh, oh. <laughs> he is still Gamma Two, still alive. So I'm kind of killing Gamma Two right now. Okay. That's Let's see what the uh, time is when you get to the. I set a new best record on the stage by two seconds. <laughs> I definitely did not. No way. Super Saiyan Four Gogeta actually got the triple super is gonna kill here. But it's because nice. I used the Spirit Bomb and then the Super Saiyan Four Goku standby right. And that's yeah. like kind of where I guess the L is. Oh, well, now go hunt. Yeah, so you used what? So you used the one to go from Goku into Oob. Did you go from Oob into full power Goku? Yeah. I mean, you have Yes, yeah, so that's like two. Oob, Oob and like then obviously you have the, uh, the yeah, going into the spirit bomb and then using the spirit bomb. So, exactly, yeah, you had like right. four unskippable animations, whereas I didn't get to use mine. So I didn't I didn't have any. So, yeah, I guess that is the difference maker. I mean, that has been a thing in the past. I remember in old races wasn't it the uh back in the day for the five nine the tournament of power didn't tiger lose to talon because he decided yeah, to use like an so. active skill so yeah I think I do remember that. <laughs> so uh That's yeah those funny. can make a big difference when you're uh when you're racing so for sure um so yeah what was your final time well jp loading is takes like 16 years so i haven't got it but, i mean yeah, you true. definitely you definitely won this one. Oh sure. yeah i just want to see what the time uh See what the time difference was, but yeah, we'll see. Um, 
I'm sorry. JP loading, it just it just takes forever. <laughs> I'm literally stuck stuck here. You know, Akatsuki definitely not watching this, but so wait, do fix. I is that do I smell another global W? Not just the exclusive tickets, but the fact the game actually works? Well, it's the fact that <laughs> I'm in America, then the game is in Japan, so the connection yeah. is pretty awful. Um but yeah, there you go. Global See everyone, just another so reason better. to play global. You know, right. <laughs> global loading is definitely much. Better. I'm still loading, by the way. I, oh god, damn! Really? <laughs> yeah, dude. Sometimes it takes me five minutes to log into JP. You're saying it's crazy. No um, way. I got ten minutes and fifty-four seconds. Uh, yeah. So mine was nine thirty-five. Yeah, so. see, that's a huge difference, but that's pretty big, yeah. There it is, guys. So yeah, so. those of you out there who doubted me, you thought <laughs> you thought I'm sure that LR Full Power Super Saiyan Four Goku was going to be the absolute trump card, but I mean, he probably did really well in the run, I'm sure. But no, yeah, he had like those a standbys, I feel like. Stat. Right, it was pretty sick. Definitely. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> For sure. And, I mean, with the full heal and everything, his value is still really up there. So that's really yep. important. I mean, that's the thing you got to remember, obviously, for like, you know, races are, of course, fun to do. But if you're playing like, you know, the hardest events in the game, you're not necessarily trying to beat them quickly. So God Goku uh, or Super Saiyan 4 Goku, even if you are taking the time to watch those animations, like he is an insane unit. So I am super hyped for him to come out on Global for sure. Yeah, yeah for sure. He's going to be really sick in December, I think, right? Is when you use November, yeah, 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 yeah. Right after, or is it after or just before Heroes? So that's going to be I a busy month for me. Yeah, I think it's right <laughs> after Heroes, actually. Yep. Right, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> Anyways, check out part two with me again. Uh, we'll be racing there. Thanks for watching, y'all. And we'll catch you in the next video. Peace. Yeah, peace out. Glow best. <laughs>